hair today is very, um, you know, quite simple. We inspired about the, um, it's a French girl, French Parisian girl. She's very, very cool, very modern. And we inspired about the hair, be like a broken texture, be sweaty, like a one day hold. The look is a little bit, I think, street inspired, but the clothes are very chic still. The makeup then, sort of same situation where you have the natural shading around the eyes, um, a little bit of contour in the cheek, and just a nice boyish brow, a little bit of squared off at the top. Starting point for me is how to express the brand theory. I've been longing for the day that I can show my vision and my inspiration for the brand and this is the day. For me it's all about proportions. I've been very naturally going to more structured volumes and structured materials that give, give shapes. Um, the brand is much about how you can mix clothes and much about how you can elevate clothes by having very interesting cut and proportions and very beautiful fabrics. I have watched Olivier since he was a youngster when he started with Rochas. I was blown away always by his light touch, his, his um, ethereal hand, and it's really feminine and wispy. And this show was all of those things. His real true heart, the heart of him, came through in this show. Mixed with a theory sensibility, sportswear pieces, the high-low dresses, the use of fabrics, the plaid, the chiffon. I just think he's one of um, my favorite designers in New York this week. I have to say that because he really is a big talent. In an environment where you, keep, you do more structured volumes, I loved to tweak it with a system of drape. Uh, but it was kind of almost systematic and repetitive um, because it's almost like a study, a study of a drape and what it offers as solutions to tweak a dress and change the, the way you see a dress. So it has been like kind of something that has driven my, my quest for shapes. I thought it was incredible. What he does, like kind of unlike anybody else, and the asymmetrical stuff that he was doing today and the playing with texture, I mean, some of those floaty skirts were just so beautiful. We are all looking and working at bringing a sense of novelty in the way the clothes are done, in, the, in pushing the technique. Obviously, when it comes to material and creation, um, it's also interesting to bring a lyrism and a, a proposition and something that make, brings dream. What I think is so exciting is that it all seems so wearable. Like, I wish I could put it all on right now. I mean, some of those coats were just so extraordinary. I always feel that it doesn't, things doesn't need to be overly creative. Just it needs to be like inspiration, I think. It's a, just a way to react to today and feel what's right. Every time I design for theory, I think of how contemporary the brand is and how it, it has a step into the future and the proposition, but also a step into a respect for the craft and a quality of classicism when it comes to how clothes are made.